So Scott Hendricks and I uh, flew to Nashville and uh, recorded uh, some tracks and then we immediately uh, got back on the airplane and flew back to Oklahoma because we had a lot of singing to do and I wanted to do it at home. Don't have to leave this town to see the world cause there's something that I gotta do. Ended up singing the vocal for uh, Nobody But You uh, in Oklahoma. Uh, at the lake house and oh we're on film well I, I didn't realize we were on film that's probably why you're acting weird and awkward about it about the time i got my vocal done uh and and scott had time to comp it and, and go through all the different takes i think i probably did eight or nine takes of the vocal because it's a it's a monster song to sing i don't want to love nobody that sucked <clears throat> I don't want to love nobody. And we timed it to where Gwen works on Wednesday, Friday, Saturdays in Las Vegas. So I was able to get her to the house on the Thursday on her day off uh, in Oklahoma to record her part of, of Nobody But You. And What's that? Oh, that's me. Why am I on the like that? Huh? What is that? I don't know, Scott made a screensaver. That's me pimping out, dude. You know how expensive those things were? I wanted those my whole life. You wanted now the those? eyebrows, on the other hand. <laughs> <laughs> Actually worked out really good because her voice is in such great shape right now because she's working so much out there. I don't know that I've ever heard her singing any better than she is right now. It's just a super strong voice right now. Just so you know, and for you to know, not even a dream of mine to be on a Blake Shelton song, but fantasy would be more like better than a dream because a fantasy is completely unlikely. Like a dream can come true. Fantasies are just something you just make up in your brain. Mm -hmm. So for you to ask me to be on this song is like... Can I ask you a question now? Mm -hmm. Are you intoxicated? I'm still learning uh, when it comes to recording with, with Gwen. Uh, we've only recorded a, literally a handful of, of songs together. Uh, but the thing that I think that I'm blown away by with Gwen is, is just how hard she works when she gets in the studio. She wants, she's, she's not uh, willing to take anything less than, than greatness, you know, and, and she's willing to put in the work. I mean, I don't care if it means she's got to get in there and, and sing till she completely loses her voice. I don't think Gwen knows how great of a vocalist she really is. And uh, even Scott Hendricks, you know, if there was a time or two when we've, when we've recorded her that, you know, she can't even hear what he's saying. He'll just lean back and go, wow. Wanna say it now, wanna make it clear For only you and God to hear When you love someone, they say you set them free And that ain't gonna work for me record a country song like Go Ahead and Break My Heart or, or uh, Nobody But You, uh, on these country recordings, there's, there's a lot of focus on, on that vocal. And, and I think it doesn't do anything but shed some great light on, on Gwen's talent. You did it. Yay! You won't be able to do your show tomorrow. This song reminds me of like, Take my breath away, or Lady in Red, Sing the dancing. It reminds me of a, uh, don't wanna close my eyes. Yeah, wow. none of those are hits. Those are horrible songs, but I would hate to be on a song like that. I don't think people have really heard her sing like this before. Let me do something official here. What's that? That is a rap on the Nobody But You recording. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Seal it with a kiss? Good idea? Oh, you mean with Scott or you? <laughs> no, with me. <laughs> oh. Oh, man. Well, let's go drink our faces off now. <laughs>